Elliot Johnson for the Bees. That's headed away well by Mark Roberts. And it's out for a throw into Barnet now. That's flicked on by John Akinde. And now Michael Gash in possession. And they've worked it well down that left hand side. It's a searching ball into the box, but Manus heads away to, only to the edge of the box. He's had a short goal and it's come back and it's in. And Barnet have taken an early lead. It's a perfect start. Mauro Villetti with the goal. And it's a disaster early on here at the Hive for the Shim. Good work there. Let's get the ball back to David Stevens. Good challenge by Hatfield. Peels for handball, but not given. That's a terrible back pass by Scott McManus. And he's just allowed John Akinde in to just slot the ball beyond Matt Glennon. And it's 2-0 with just a couple of minutes left in the first half. John Akinde with his 31st goal of the season. But what was Scott McManus thinking with that attempted back pass to Matt Glennon? Now the ball is rolling again with Stack getting the ball moving. That's Yerdham's ball forward from right to left. It's been headed away but only as far as Weston. Gash now. Great ball in. Valete. He's got support now with Yerdham. Chance for him to put the ball in the box. He's trying to get beyond McManus. He's done that brilliantly. Excellent work by Yerdham and Curtis Weston makes it 3-0. Yeardham on that right hand side danced around the Halifax defence and when the ball was rolled across to Western it was a simple task for the Barnet skipper to make it Barnet FC 3, FC Halifax Town 0.